What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about the Grandmaster crafting stations that are going to be coming out with update 40. And we got a little bit more information about this in the update 40 preview. Before I get into all the details, be sure to check out everything down in the description. The community discord, my Twitter, and of course if you enjoyed the video hit the like button. And if you have not subscribed to the channel yet, I hope you consider subscribing. Update 40 will introduce Grandmaster crafting stations allowing you to consolidate all your home's attuned crafting stations for a crafting skill line into a single furnishing. If your uh, base of operations is packed full of attuned crafting stations uh, support, supporting many of ESO's item sets, these new uh, consolidated stations will go a long way to improve the amount of housing slots spent within or without giving up any of the functionality you enjoyed previously. You can acquire these at the Grandmaster Crafting Station using RIT vouchers, the Achievement Mediator, or uh, Faustina, of course, will have these available to, uh, at her you know, area as well. There will be consolidated stations for blacksmith, jewelry crafting, clothing, and woodworking. And this is something that people have wanted for a really long time because it does not seem like we're going to get any more housing furniture spaces anytime soon. And one of the big issues is if you're in a guild, you own a guild, or you know, you just like to collect all the stuff in the game, crafting stations, uh, crafting stations take up so much room. And it's really hard to decorate the house at all. You have some of these monstrous, really cool looking homes, and the only thing you really have in them is crafting stations and probably Munda Stones if you own a guild. Because that's really the only thing you can put in some of them. They take up so much room between you know blacksmithing jewelry crafting clothing and woodworking now those can be consolidated down into you know one attunable table for each thing and that's going to be a big big plus for anyone who has a house with tons of crafting stations so i'm kind of curious what you guys think do you think this is kind of their way around that's kind of how i feel about it it's their way around ever really adding more furniture slots to the game they're probably thinking you know it's going to be hard to get you know everything to work correctly they've already said that in the past old gen consoles were kind of holding back uh, the amount of things they can do for homes uh, and really uh, the amount of furniture they could put in them so i think this is a great idea to at least give you some of that space back instead of having to have tons of tables for each individual you know thing you, got, you have to have you know for each individual kind of set you're having to have a blacksmith jewelry clothing and woodworking for each individual set now you can have that one attunable station and that should help out a lot anyway guys leave me a comment with your thoughts let me know what you think you think they're going to be expensive that's kind of curious i'm, I'm kind of curious to see how many tickets they're going to cost that's going to be one thing when these items come out that's going to be a hot ticket item people are going to be really looking for these grandmaster crafting stations uh, to use with their writ vouchers and i'm really going to be curious too to see if you can sell them like you can a lot of the items you can uh, you or a lot of the items that you can get with the writ vouchers because these things will be going for a really high price, I would guess. Leave me a comment with your thoughts, and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.